To build an application within Storyboard Designer, it's important to understand the components that exist within this environment. Starting with the application, you can set properties like the dimensions that will dictate whether or not your application is a landscape or horizontal app. It gives you the overall view. Within this view that you're looking at, it's going to be showing to you on a screen. At all times, you're going to be on a screen within your application. You aren't limited to the number of screens that you have in your app either. It can be a one screen app or several. It's up to you. Now the content that you see isn't placed directly onto the screen, but instead, content is placed onto layers, and layers are extremely important when it comes to planning and organizing your application. You can use the same layer over multiple screens, like a menu layer that you'd use for navigation. If you wanted to move from one screen to another, you'd have your navigation layer on those screens. Layers can also contain unique content that's used only for a particular screen. Planning what content goes into a layer is very important and planning which of those layers are on what screens will help you keep organized and really help the process of developing your application go smoothly. Now on to controls. Controls, you must learn controls. The content that you see in a layer is a control. Everything ends up inside of a control. Controls are the stuff that applications are made of and their properties are set by their render extensions. You can think of a control as a container, and with a container you need to put something in it. So you can think of render extensions as something that fills that container. Now render extensions can be text, it can be an image, a background color, it can be a 3D object, several other things and combinations of these both. Controls exist within layers, and those layers populate a screen, or multiple screens and it's the screens that exist within the application that has all of this content functioning on a whole. Understanding this hierarchy and how to organize and plan within this environment is essential to help you build a successful application.